Have you ever noticed how most people go through their day with a constant stream of negative thoughts? It's like their mind is running on autopilot, creating scenarios and problems that will never actually happen. And even if some challenges do arise, they're usually nothing more than minor obstacles that can be overcome. It's funny how we've all fallen into this pattern without even realizing it. Unless, of course, you've made a conscious effort to become aware of your thinking or have tried meditation. These practices can help reveal the power of your mind, but with great power comes great responsibility. Imagine giving a chainsaw to someone who has no control over their limbs. That's how dangerous an uncontrolled mind can be. And here's the thing. It's not just affecting your mental well-being, it's physically killing you. If you observe people on the street, you'll see them functioning as cortisol-producing machines. They're constantly stressed and anxious, and it shows in their posture and interactions. The impact of this chronic stress on our bodies has become increasingly clear. So, it's no wonder that more and more people are recognizing the value of being present in the moment. However, there are two major obstacles to fully embracing presence, the past and the future. Most people find it easier to reconcile the past with the present. They understand the concept of not letting past regrets or mistakes negatively affect their current moment. But when it comes to the future, things get complicated. How do you set goals and have a powerful vision while remaining present in the moment? This is where people tend to fall into two extremes. The first extreme is the rat racer mentality. These individuals are constantly chasing promotions, raises, and external validations of success. They obsess over future milestones, and their happiness is always tied to achieving those goals. Unfortunately, this pattern leads to a never-ending cycle of stress and dissatisfaction. The second extreme is the misinterpretation of spiritual teachings. Some people, after reading books like Eckhart Tolle's The Power of Now, decide that goals and visions are just ego gratification. They believe that true enlightenment can be found by renouncing all desires and staying fully present in the moment. While this may be an improvement over the rat racer mentality, it's still an incomplete understanding. To find a balance between a meaningful future and present moment awareness, let's turn to an analogy from Tal Ben-Shahar. Imagine you're a mountain climber. The peak of the mountain represents your vision or goal, the ultimate achievement you're striving for. But happiness doesn't lie solely in reaching the peak. It's the experience of climbing towards it that brings fulfillment. And just like a mountain climber, you can have a vision and set goals while staying present in the journey. This perspective allows you to appreciate the present moment while working towards that worthy goal. It's not about attaching your happiness solely to the achievement of the goal but finding joy and fulfillment in the process. And no, this doesn't mean disregarding planning or the future. In fact, Eckhart Tolle himself has accomplished great things by setting goals and taking action. So, embrace the idea of climbing towards your peak, all while enjoying the present moments along the way. Find that balance between ambition and mindfulness. And remember, your journey is just as important as the destination. Now, how do you plan to implement this in your life? What actions will you take to create a fulfilling future while staying present in the moment? If you found this video valuable in understanding the power of presence and goal setting, consider subscribing to our channel, liking this video, and hitting the notification bell. By doing so, you'll stay updated with our latest content that can help you achieve your goals and live a more fulfilled life. And hey, if you felt that this video has provided significant value to you, consider giving a tip proportional to the value received. You'll find the link in the video description. Your support allows us to continue creating informative and insightful content for you. Thank you for being a part of our community.